Are you getting the critical system mirror whenever you launch or play Valorant? In this video, we'll walk you through the steps on what you need to do to address this problem. It's always highly recommended that you keep the software environment of your PC updated. You'll need to do this whether or not you have an issue or not. Make sure that you update your Windows OS and third-party games to lessen the chances of problems. A simple yet effective way to get rid of temporary bugs is to refresh the system by rebooting it. To do that, simply turn your PC off, unplug it from the power outlet for 30 seconds and restart the computer. Another important thing to update, especially since you are dealing with an error, is your graphics card drivers. Like most games and software, your GPU should check for updates automatically, but should you wish to do the checking manually, you can visit their official websites. Another possible solution to Valorant crashing issue is to ensure that you run the game as an administrator. This will prevent Windows from blocking any game-related services, which may be the one causing the problem. Here's what you need to do. In your keyboard, press Windows key R once you've opened the Run dialog box, type services.msc, and press Enter in the Services window. Search for the VGC service, right-click on the service, and go to Properties in the Properties window. Make sure that the startup type is automatic and the service is running. Click Apply and then hit OK. Go to the installation folder for Valorant and go to Riot Games. Valorant Live Shooter Game Binaries Win64 Path Right click on the Valorant Win64 shipping file and select Properties. Click on Compatibility tab and check the Run This Program as an Administrator option. If you're still getting the same error, the next troubleshooting step that you can do is to try to see if the problem is caused by a third-party application. To do that, make sure that you don't run anything other than Valorant. Alternatively, you can try to identify which program is causing the problem using the process of elimination. Just close programs one by one and check which one causes the error to stop showing. If you can identify the main culprit using this method, be sure to remove or delete it from the system for good, or you can simply choose not to run it whenever you are playing Valorant. If you are using an overclocked CPU or GPU, it's time that you consider reverting to the base speed. Some gamers have fixed the critical system error on Valorant this way. That's it. We hope this video is helpful to you. Please subscribe to know our latest videos in the future.